There's a theory that we look for love only to fulfil a perceived lack within ourselves. That if we were content with who we were, there'd be no need to look to others to complete us, like the proverbial syringe full of Botox into the upper lip of a Gold Coast housewife. <laughs> There's an opposing argument, though, that suggests that it is only once we are content with who we are that we may truly allow ourselves to be loved. That it's not until we're emotionally mature enough to love ourselves that we may accept the love of another person and capture that crafty concept of true, everlasting love. The kind of love reserved exclusively for people who own pug dogs. Oh, look at his stupid little fucking face. 